All right. So uh, maybe let's begin with you. Yes, Nancy. Yes. Okay. So the essence of Section 55 of Acts 977 is to safeguard against multiplicity of suits and to safeguard against people coming to legal aid to go against the tenets of the commission, of the legal aid commission. We are serving the poor. We've been established to serve the poor, to offer free legal services to the poor, the indigent, and vulnerable. Therefore, if you come to legal aid and you come to lie, even though you don't qualify for legal aid, then you have, you have, you have uh, defeated the purpose of the establishment of the commission, right. which is to help citizens who are poor, citizens who are impoverished, citizens who cannot afford three square meals. Mm. Yes. Right. Yes. Um, what will you add to that, Rita? Well, um, nothing much, but to add and say that I don't think it should scare anybody okay. from coming forth to apply for legal services if um, the need arises. I mean, we are there to serve the general public. And just like my, my friend said, because we are overwhelmed with cases, we don't want people who are able or who can be able to acquire the services of a private lawyer mm -hmm. or private lawyers also coming in to seek free legal services. Sort of compete yes, with to those compete who can the afford. indigents. Mm -hmm. Yes, we don't want a situation like that. So if you're an indigent, if you are not qualified, if you don't fall within our criteria and you cannot um, afford the services of a private legal practitioner, this provision shouldn't scare you. You mm -hmm. should always come. In any case, when you come, we would um, conduct the means test. If right. you're not qualified, we will tell you outright and then we'll dismiss your case. If you are qualified, we'll proceed and um, give you the free legal services. So it shouldn't scare anybody at all. all right. Just walk into us and talk to us. Okay. We also do not want to take the work of private legal practitioners from them. <laughs> Else, legal aid would be a, a first option for, for every citizen in Ghana. And that would take the work from our private legal practitioners who might have also spent money in paying their school fees. <laughs> and they also have to right. earn and benefit from okay. their work. Okay.